It turns out, Frontier, the developers of Planet Coaster, are aware of what we've done before in this game. And they approached both myself and Call Me Kevin specifically with the task to build the worst park possible. I saw Kevin's park. Baby Steps. Amateur level park. He didn't kill nearly enough people as he could have. His park wasn't efficient with murder. So we're gonna one-up him. I am proudly sponsored by Frontier for this video to design the worst theme park possible. We're playing Planet Coaster Console Edition on PS5. If you like what you see in this video, there's a link in the description below to check out the game for yourself. Planet Coaster Console Edition is also available on PS4, Xbox One, and both Xbox Series S and X. What do we name the park? First things first. Just hell? <laughs> it's just hell itself. There's no other name for it. Come on, kids! We're gonna take you to hell today! Yeah, I love hell! Fun for all the family. Before anything else, uh, like the most important thing, marketing. None else matters if no one else is coming to your park. What's the most expensive marketing campaign we can do? Family hour. Let's get as many kids as we can. I don't want janitors because that implies the place will be clean. It's close enough to Christmas, as far as I'm concerned this year. Let's get the King Coasters. Currently losing $6,000 a month, but that's fine. We need more festive King Coasters. I want these guys to outnumber the actual people at the park. This family is just mobbed in the middle. <laughs> Look at their happy faces. <laughs> Are you having a fun time at hell? We're gonna create a custom coaster. Uh, is there a filter for speed? And now I just want <laughs> it. I could just make it like a straight vertical drop. I can make it so the track just goes through the people. Here it comes. Oh no! It passed over their heads. I don't think it's quite getting them. What's going wrong? It's not hitting them. It's somehow avoiding all the people, which is no good. Oh, there we go! <laughs> Okay, so yeah, that that is now getting a steady flow of people. Why isn't it hitting the mascots? It's specifically hitting like the park goers. It's just it's filtering out the crowd. It needs to complete testing. Oh, it needs to complete on the track, doesn't it? How high up can we get again on one swing? Okay, that that's a good indication so we can go a little higher. Oh, ahead for heights. We got a trophy. It's jaw-dropping. The reviews are coming in for our park. Coasting along. What? Jesus, this seems like a great park. I'm, I'm getting every accomplishment. Scream if you want to go fast. <laughs> we can make the iron horse. It could be a train. Yeah, this will take you around. The, this is this is going to be nice. It's just a relaxing train ride. There's, not, there's nothing nefarious with this one. So now you can tour the magic that is our derelict field. You get a full view of all the wild, exciting rides that await you in hell. Okay, I just need to connect this to the path, and I think people will actually use it. Obstruct it. We will get this to work. I think it's on the ground now. We've done it. Market and Muggle. Another achievement. I like the arch we've created. It's simultaneously uh, wheelchair accessible and then not at all. Uh, what are we going to call this one? The Boring Express. Yeah, I mean, there's nothing really like, inherently wrong uh, with this attraction. It's just really dull. Okay, now real quick, I need to, I need to... <laughs> we want it so there's 20 trains. <laughs> and in the speed, we want it to be as low as possible at five miles an hour. <laughs> so now when you're in this part of the park, you can also just hear the train sirens just screeching. The first train is off. There's nothing to use the Boring Express for. 4% of guests, right? Who say they want to go on. The same 4% of people say there's nothing to do. Everyone who gets on the train is like, why have I done this? But the nice thing is, because we have this backlog of trains, that first train can't finish until the previous 20 trains have made a lap of the track. Because they're gonna get caught in traffic. So that means you really get to take in the ride. There's a lot of litter in the park, make sure there are enough bins. I mean... I know there's people in these costumes, but you could probably fit some garbage if you just toss it in the mouse. You know, and they'll dispose of it later. Like, they'll be fine. There's like a buffer between the person and the mascot costume. Many guests need the toilet. I gave him a toilet. Can I make it so it costs money? Five dollars. It is a privilege 
to be able to use the loot in this team park. Okay, so the spicy chicken is the one that's probably going to make him need the loot the most. So we're going to hand out as much spicy chicken as possible. It's free. The spicy chicken is just straight up free. And there's nothing else on the menu. So that's going to destroy their bowels. And then we get him with the $5 for the loot. <laughs> the trains! Look at how slow they go! <laughs> how long does it take to complete the ride? Fast forward. So it was 11.30 when we started. Every time there's a slight incline too, it seems that the trains really struggle. So an hour has now passed. Five hours. Like, at what point do you just jump off the train? Like, you might break your leg from that height, but at what point do you just chance it? A full day has now passed. At this point in time, hunger is starting to kick in. Everyone on the train is also severely dehydrated. Look at the date, Dan. Wait, oh my god, no, the day is changing much faster than the time. Oh no, if you look at the date, and if we view that, the metric, it's, it's, it's now June. I think when people got on the train, it was... I think it was April. The Casket Express! Oh no, I think Express is an overstatement. This train ain't going quick. Okay, we still haven't hit the traffic jam, which is unfortunate. Uh, so this is the endurance part of the train. We have to wait for all these other trains to go. And these tra trains leaving the station, I believe, is dependent on other people getting on the ride. So now you've just stopped entirely. In fairness to them, they've almost made it back. There's just, two, there's just three trains between them and freedom. You can only live three days without water. <laughs> well, you know, it's just survival of the fittest. <laughs> this family, like, they just want to go home. God love them, they've still got smiles on their faces after all this time. Oh my god. They made it. How, how are the guests doing? The Boring Express is amazing. The queue for the Boring Express was really fast. I'm bored of looking at the Boring Express. Fireworks displays. Oh. Oh, this looks magical. Put one of them there. And then what we're gonna do is we're just gonna fill the path with as many as possible. This is a fire hazard. Oh, it's fine. See, the mascots will catch fire first, so the guests will actually be safe if you think about it. You know, those ma mascots are just gonna go up in flames. So what I need to do now is I think I just need to get more attractions in the park so that I can trick more people into coming in. Okay, it begins. This is the first of many. Uh, adding them on is just taking a brief moment to render just because there's so many parts, I believe, right now. Well, how, how does the blender do so far? We can start testing it while, like, while we're going. Oh, God! Oh, it goes quick! <laughs> this mine is 17, jeez! <laughs> right, built for two! Oh, that one just launched! A vertical drop coaster using wide, high capacity flawless cars for an extra feeling of rider vulnerability. So we can get a vertical drop on this one. Oh god, this one can go upside down as well. <laughs> Hang on, how bad can you make this one? I just want it so like it just spirals down to your demise. <laughs> There's like beams set up for this. Like this structure needs some support. Yo, you're not gonna be able to hit the, the like the park goers, okay? If the entire thing collapses. Okay, here we go. We're at the top. And now we go into free fall. Here we go. You better hang on. Here comes the shoestring. <laughs> oh god. Are the people okay? This is the moment where things went wrong. <laughs> let's, res let's resume time. <laughs> She's gone. <laughs> she just got launched. Uh, I think it's time, because they're not riding this one anyway, we should probably just disconnect this one. How much damage can it cost? <laughs> she it hits the train. Okay, if I try time, <laughs> I don't know what's about to happen. <laughs> Look at this little kid. Pictures taken moments before disaster. <laughs> Away they go. That's a sturdy train. At least it keeps them safe. Surely this is enough in terms of food. 
so that, uh, you know, they'll all stop saying, like, just screaming I'm hungry. And, like, I'm thirsty. And fix the roller coaster. I think it just hit my dad. Because I'm getting real tired of those complaints. Okay, so I, I want to make the boring train worse. And I actually did just have an idea. Terrain? I go to Sculpting. What if I just, like, encase it? So it's just darkness. So now it's just three days in the dark. So you're probably just gonna go insane as well. There are people on the ride currently who probably just see, like, the light just being snuffed out. <laughs> like, we gotta escape! It's like, Dad, I'm scared! I'm scared too, we just have to be brave. We bought the day pass and we're gonna make use of it. People were always saying that, like, you know, the scenery was too boring. So now there's a little bunch of rock formations. I think that's gonna be much more exciting. Oh god, the problem is this gets very close to the path. This is gonna start to encase the land below as well. Oh god, this goes right through the park. The game just goes to show that, you know, anyone can be an artist. And just because your art is different from what society expects, doesn't mean you're any less talented. <laughs> there we go. It's done. The dark train is complete. Yes! We've created an ocean. <laughs> it's beautiful. <laughs> Wait, no, this is calm water. What if we make it make it dirty water? Now it's all sewage. Okay, what I need to do now is because they're all funneled in here. I need to get a car like a coaster that drops it in here and it just like scrambles around inside the interior. So when this these four meters, the hydraulic launch will get you to 78 meters per second. An acceleration of 20 meters per second squared. No track supports, too. I think, I think the only support you might find on this coaster is from God. Because I don't fancy your chances otherwise. Oh, God! <laughs> this guy's like, solution. It's like, Godspeed. I have the best job in the world. I don't work a day in my life. I think it needs to come off just a little sooner. I feel like there's a... I can hit more people. Just that little bit earlier, and I think that will make all the difference. Yes, yes it does! Oh, that's perfect. Yeah, that's exactly what we want. And the carrots just like funnel through the crowd! There's <laughs> so many people injured! They're just getting hit by the coaster now and like, rolling in the garbage! <laughs> Those people just want to get to the park faster. They've got the fast pass. That's all it is. We just give you the kick you need to get to the front of the line. Crashing the party trophy, Ern. <laughs> oh, gee, yeah. I, no, I think I've crashed it, all right. I love how a game's just like, after doing everything, it's like, here's an achievement. You're doing so good. That park's going on the fridge. I don't I don't think Kevin stands a chance. Like, I, I'm just too familiar with killing people in this, like, fun family, like, theme park game. And God, do I love my job. I'm gonna get, like, a bullet train. <laughs> It'll be a bullet, all right. It's gonna f it, it can only go down at a 30 degree angle. Yeah, we gotta do a wide blender just to get down. Okay, here is the end. Oh, God! We're almost at our destination. I want to see what it looks like from down here. We just have to... <laughs> we just gotta last a moment until the train comes down. Let's give it a moment and we'll be okay. I'll create some more staff in the meantime. We could use some. Here comes the train! Here it comes! <laughs> it doesn't even make it! After all that... <laughs> this guy's had a bad day. Oh, I'm pretty sure that's killed everyone. Take that, Kevin. I had a lot of fun with this session. I think you can probably tell. Thank you so much again to Frontier for actually sponsoring me to do this. Planet Coaster Console Edition is now available on PS4, PS5, Xbox One, and Xbox Series S and X. Link in the description below.